Hey everyone, it's uh, Jeannie with Talk To Me Tuesday, October the 28th. I'm hoping everyone's had an absolutely wonderful week, wonderfully crafty week. Um, I did have a huge finish this week. I finished my cathedral window. I don't have it here to show you because it's already been washed, dried, and put on my bed. Um, it, was, it was on my bed Sunday evening as soon as I got it done. And I love it. It turned out just, I just completely, completely love it. Um, what I w did was I just, about every day, I'd work four to five hours on it every day. Um, once I started making progress, then I just needed to see it through. And um, there was no reason for me to, you know, work on it and then go back and forth. I really need to kind of start wrapping up some of these projects that I've got going on. And I was, I was on the end of that quilt, so I just decided to go ahead and see it through. So, I worked on it pretty much every evening for a few hours. Um, worked on it pretty heavily on the weekends. And um, by Saturday, I realized that I could get this done. I can get this done this weekend. So, I just went ahead and powered through it over the weekend. And I'm so, so happy that it's done. I'll add a picture uh, for those of you who haven't seen it on Instagram or Facebook. And um, so I'll add a picture to my post. Uh, anyways, uh, so I worked on that. Um, of course, this week is Halloween. Happy Halloween, everyone. Um, usually, I go all out for Halloween. And this year, we've made a decision not to. Uh, so, no outside decorations are up. I do have my wreath that my sister-in-law made me up in the house. And then I also put up my Hocus Pocus quilt this year. Um, but we've decided to keep things pretty low-key for Halloween. It also means that my uh, yearly big costume... Um, I, I usually go pretty big on my costumes every year. And... Um, it's also, I've also decided not to, um, do a big costume. Um, I had two ideas. I briefly thought about it, gave it, uh, some thought. Um, one was going as Dolores Umbridge because, you know, it's 2020 and it just felt completely appropriate to dress like her this year. Um, but getting a pink suit, um, I don't have a lot of pink that I could have pulled that off. So, and then my second idea was actually to go as the Mandalorian and then use my, my stuffed baby Yoda, like strap him, you know, on. Um, so I thought about doing that too, but in the end it would have, would have required a lot of effort to get the Mandalorian costume together. So I just decided, you know what, I'm just going to sit this one out um, and then next year, I'll just go big. I'll just go big for 2021. Um, anyway, so, uh, kind of, uh, you know, I had that stuff going on in the back of my mind. Uh, Halloween, and then, you know, we've got the holidays coming up in general, and, um, we're trying to figure out, you know, how we're going. We usually do a pretty big Thanksgiving. We're going to back that off a little bit. Um, anyways, it's, uh, uh, but this is not just me. This is everyone. Everyone's having to make these decisions and, um, it's kind of stressful. It's like, oh, well, just don't do it. And that's not, um, we got to do something. I just haven't completely decided what. So got that going on. After I finished my cathedral window, I haven't done anything, um, I do believe this weekend is going to be dedicated to mask, um, and I'm I'm going to put one more solid weekend into mask making, and um, I have several that I'm wanting to make. I may even make some Christmas ones, some holiday ones, just to go ahead and have them done, um, and then I'll be done with mask for a while. I have to tell you. I'm, I'm dreading it, but I need to get them done. But I want to make one more good hit on mask, and then I can focus on my um, Rankin and Bass quilt. Uh, because now that I got my cathedral window completely off my list, I want to get my Rankin Bass 
completely off my list. But I need to get this. I need to get these masks done this weekend. So that's what I plan on working on this weekend. Um, so, anyways, I hope and everyone has an absolutely wonderful week, a wonderfully crafty week, and I will see y'all next week. Bye.